This is without a doubt the best protected anchorage in the Florida Keys. But you gotta be able to get in there. Check it out and I'll show you how. Hi there, I'm Chris. This is my wife Jamie. And my daughters, Ava and Lola. Oh, and our dog Maggie. We sold everything we had and bought our new home on water. Come along with us as we share our love for Jesus, people, and the oceans. We hope that you are inspired to share your faith with others, make do? memories together, and travel more. Thanks for watching and subscribe. Good morning. Uh, right now we're at Curry Hammock Anchorage and Lola and I, we are going to catch some fish. Aren't we Lola? We're gonna catch some fishies. How many do you about this one? All right, hold on. Today we are extra thankful for our buddy boat that's been here before because I said that we would never go anywhere on our charts that said five foot and our charts are saying some crazy numbers right now. It is shallow. Ooh wee. Ooh wee is right. We're supposed to hug the reds. Nerve wracking that is. Get in some room. It's like tailgating on a sailboat. Okay, so curry hammock. If you're looking at the Florida Keys on a map, Curry Hammock State Park is between Crawl Key and Little Crawl Key, providing a perfect protected anchorage from any direction of wind. All right, now let's talk about how to get in there. Curry Hammock State Park is on the Atlantic side. The biggest thing you need to know when getting into Curry Hammock is go at high tide, especially if you have a draft of around five feet or more. Our draft on our Leopard 43 is 4.3 and we saw under 5 foot. Is stay to the reds. Hug the reds the whole way. When you, even when you have to go into the first few markers and you have to cut over, you want to go straight to the reds the whole way. Once you're in there, you're in there. It is big enough for three boats, I would say. There could be 20, 30, 40 knots of wind and you are well protected. While you're anchored out at Curry Hammock State Park, be on the lookout in the mangroves for iguanas on a sunny day. You can also take advantage of some really nice fishing for mangrove snapper there. If you want to stretch your legs and get on land, Curry Hammock State Park has nice beach access and a nice little playground for the kids. I didn't know a sailor wore shoes like that. Yeah. <laughs> hey! Oh, get your shoes <laughs> <laughs>
Hey guys, thanks again for watching. Uh, we are super thankful that we can make these videos and continue our journey. Uh, just to let you know, there are two ways now to be able to give. Uh, we have been under the Global Service Network, which is a nonprofit. 501c3, they're tax deductible. You can give one-time donations or become a monthly donor uh, to help in our ministry. Also, uh, we do have a patron account now. Uh, so if you want to donate there, you can do that as well. Uh, there are many ways to give. Just click on the description down below or you can see it in the about page. Uh, again, thank you guys so much. We could not keep this going uh, without a little help. So we definitely appreciate you. Um, hopefully you gained something out of these videos. <laughs> Some of it's, uh, you know, our travels and uh, hopefully you could either be inspired or uh, any of the how-to's that we post or anything like that. Popular anchorages like this. Uh, it's, uh, I kind of feel bad about even posting that just because that's our favorite little protected anchorage. But, you know, when, when you're in the Keys, it's kind of hard to find a good protected anchorage like that. So uh, there you go. And I hope you can uh, make use of it. Thanks again, guys. And we'll see you soon.